My name is Purcell Dagger. I'm a running coach and a certified trainer. I was inspired to become a coach by the careers of my parents. My dad is a social worker, my mother's a pastor, and they instilled in me this idea of community care as well as self-care and supporting people in how they care for themselves and how they care for others. They call me the people's coach. I think it speaks to this idea of me being accessible, me being someone who is for everyone, me being, uh, my approach to coaching is very much people-centered. And I think that's something that is very much resonating with people, but also they can feel it in how I show up in spaces, how I go about coaching. My fitness philosophy is rooted in being an invitation to people and not being indicting to people. I think my goal is to support people in their goals by meeting them where they are and inviting them to support themselves en route to finding joy and success within their fitness journey. A typical training session with me is gonna start with a check-in, just a moment to get a sense for how you're showing up today, how you're feeling. From there, we're getting to work. Look, up, up, like sun rays, light work, like a Sunday. No, I can't spend some time unless the ordeal come with some pay. But like, I know people want to see like a bunch of like trainers and people like me working out, but I think it's more impactful when you see like the everyday person who like, you don't really think of them as like a fit human and they do something that makes you go like, oh, that was dope. When people ask me, like, how do you stay motivated? I'm like, I don't. And I think once you accept that, it becomes a lot more palatable and accessible for people to have success. Cause it's like, you know, I don't, like I don't go to the gym with a smile on my face. Like I can't wait to work out today. That's just not real. Good. My personal fitness routine is a bit extreme. I work out about six days a week. I run about four to five days a week. I lift weights about three to four days a week. So in total, I have about six days out the week in which I'm doing something. And I think for me, it works. I have a goal of completing a transcontinental race later this year where I'm running from LA to New York. Uh, I started running about 10 years ago and I was really inspired to do this run by the career accomplishments of Dick Gregory. Uh, he was a comedian and an activist who completed the transcontinental run back in, I believe, 1977 and 1976. I'm running through predominantly black and brown neighborhoods because I recognize that black and brown folks are disproportionately impacted by heart disease, but it's also the greatest, uh, number one cause of death in America. So for me, it's about inspiring people not to just find joy in running, but also to help combat heart disease and further their life expectancy. I want my impact as a coach to be reflected in uh, the number of black and brown folks that are impacted by heart disease. I think if I can lower that percentage by half a percent, one percent, five percent in my lifetime, I think that would be a great litmus test to assess the impact of the work that I do. Outside of that, I think on a personal level, I really just want to continue to be the catalyst for why people fall in love with the idea of self-care through movement. And if I can do that, I think I did a good job.